Some of you might think that starting in the STEAM education's learning might be expensive and costly. But how much exactly did you need in order to start in the STEAM education's learning? Hey, this is Coach Chris. In this video, I'm going to share with you what is the minimum amount in order to start in the STEAM education's learning. So STEAM education's learning might hurt like quite expensive in order to start up because in the last decade, the only popular robotic kits that we have is the Lego robotic kits, which now currently what you can get from the market now is around 2,000 ringgit Malaysia. And now you might find more different kind of robotic kits nowadays but also will cost you maybe around a few hundred ringgit Malaysia until a few thousand ringgit Malaysia. So I understand the concern. What you are worrying is after you bought it and after some times when the children lost their interest or stopped learning, it might be a waste. And it is a waste of a few hundred to few thousand ringgit Malaysia. But that are referring to those uh, closed source robotic kits that I have previously discussed in my previous video and nowadays we have another option which are the open source robotic kits so for example if you would like to start with learning how to construct a line following robot what are the components that you will need to construct the line following robot is first the arduino which is the microcontroller where we can get around 20 ringgit and a robot chases which also we can get around 20 ringgit two iron sensors each of them is around 6 ringgit and a motor driver which is around 7 ringgit so the total cost is just around 60 ringgit so if you would like to add one more features for this robot for example to avoid obstacles what you need to do is buy one more sensor which we call it as a ultrasonic sensor you just need to add another 6 ringgit on it so you can see the cost is extremely low when you compare to a existing robotic kits that you can buy from the market and what is the great thing is you can just buy those components that you need in order to enhance your project or robot. So if you say I'm not interested in building the robot, instead I'm more interested in building some projects like auto plant watering system or bugler detection system. All these projects will require you to interface with different kinds of sensors. For example, you need soil moisture sensors, you need um, PIR sensors for bugler. Uh, detection system so you might get a set of sensor kits from the market just around like 150 ringgit so if you say that maybe i won't need to use all the sensors the good thing is you can buy those sensors that you want one by one so each sensors maybe cost around 6 to 10 ringgit only so it means that you can start learning by just buying the Arduino microcontroller which is around 20 ringgit and some other components such as the LEDs, breadboard and some buttons so that you can start learning programming the Arduino with less than 30 ringgit and that might be another thing that comes into your mind how about the lessons the classes to learn all these things well my suggestion for you is if you are a self learner which means that you are able to learn by yourself by following all these um, tutorials or uh, lessons from online you might get all this free knowledge from the youtube or one of the, my favorite website which is the instructables where it shows you a step-by-step -step instructions on how to do this project you can even go to the community group to get those informations and to interact with all those um, makers all around the world as well. But what if you say you can't learn independently? So my suggestion for you is you might go and find for those robotic classes or STEM STEAM classes like uh, what we organize as well. We have our RoboForce Academy that, that will teach you all of these things. Or you might also can go for those online classes which is quite affordable and we are currently planning to do it as well. So as you can see, if you would like to really start in this STEAM education learning, the minimum cost that you need to spend is only just a few 10 ringgit. All right? So I don't think it will be difficult for everyone in order to start in the STEAM education learning. So I hope this video is able to correct your concept which is starting in STEAM education learning is expensive and costly. And I hope every student will give it a try in starting in the STEAM education learning. So that's all for this video. Thank you very much. I hope I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.